So is natural gas a clean alternative? If extracted safely, it's the bridge fuel that can power our economy with less of the carbon pollution that causes climate change. No, fracked gas is a double whammy for the climate. Increasing the availability of natural gas supplies in the region is important to the economy and the environment. The Atlantic Coast Pipeline will provide a cleaner source of fuel. Natural gas is 90% methane, a climate-changing greenhouse gas that is 86 times more potent than CO2. The project will mean cleaner air in the region. State-of-the-art natural gas plants replace coal plants from the 1950s and 60s. Gas leaks from natural gas wells, pipelines, compressor stations, and every part of the supply chain, releasing methane into the atmosphere. Natural gas, as you know, has much lower emissions than coal. Once the gas gets where it's going, it still has to be burned, where it releases CO2. This, combined with all the leakage, makes natural gas as bad or worse for the climate as burning coal. To stop climate change, coal, gas, and oil reserves need to be kept in the ground. This means an immediate halt to all new gas power plants, wells, pipelines, and other extreme energy infrastructure. It also means phasing out existing fossil fuel infrastructure and replacing it with renewable energy. Amazingly, FERC ignores the climate change impacts of natural gas when it considers new projects. This is a huge problem because natural gas now surpasses coal in producing electricity for the United States. And all of the new gas infrastructure being built now is planned to be used for at least the next 40 years. Can we afford FERC approving another 40 years of fossil fuel infrastructure at a moment when we need to be rapidly shifting to wind, solar, and energy efficiency?